there are times when you have to query by the name of the person. And this is the select that will do that for you. When entering the name, you want to enter the last name with a comma and no spaces and maybe the first couple characters of the first name. It's hard to know how that name has been formatted on documents. So this will give you more than you need, but at least you won't miss what you do need. Here you see there's all the names that started with Thompson, comma, R. And of course we can always pick the one that we want to use. That and we'll zoom right to it. As in this one, it's going to select go from the list that we originally created. Or we can go up here to the ellipsis. We can export those names to a comma delimited file. We can view them in the attribute table as before. Or we can remove that select once again. To go back to the main menu, we have to hit the word selection and the back arrow. And you're back at the selection menu.